Well, if, I don't know if you can see the map from where you <laughs> are. Some there, of you but, guys have maps here. But there's a great Coombsville map um, here that the that the growers and vintners have put together, which really shows the topography. And they talk about that Coombsville is an old volcanic caldera, so basically like the mouth of an old volcano. So they surmise that the the ash basically went straight up and then it settled down in the lava. So you, you find these these little pumice stones all over um, Coombsville, which are these lightweight sort of white um, volcanic rock. I and mean, it really is like pumice almost. Um, and you find those. There's also three main creeks that run through alluvial deposits. But I think for me, what I think of when I think of Coombsville is that white volcanic ash in the soil. And it really gives the wines a strong character. Like in Oakville, we have the red soils on the east side that produce a certain style of wine that's very dark and aromatic. I think in Coombsville, you have that proximity to the bay that gives you all that acidity and um, even better color, I'd say, because of the cooler temperatures. Um, but the soil is also, it's well-drained. So you're, you're cooler, but unlike Carneros, which is mostly clay soils, we have this great vol uh, grain, sorry, well-drained volcanic soil. And so the wines have the concentration that people love when they think of Napa Valley. But for me, the wines have a more sort of European profile in terms of the aromas and the amount of acidity. And I, I really love that. So I didn't even choose um, Coombsville. My wife, Annie, is a viticulturist. And she came home one day and said that she found our property. And I, <laughs> we lived downtown Napa back then. This is almost 20 years ago. And I said, this, this is our property. What are you talking about? Anyway, we ended up buying a great little property in Coombsville. And that was our start and now we are almost two decades in and have this great little winery so so it chose you it chose well <laughs> it was chosen for me